Chapter 6 from the Enlightenment of the Whole Body The Essence of Devotional Practice The Sacrifice of Man A Free Rendering of the Bhagavata Purana Book 11, Chapter 12, Verses 1 and 2 and 22 through 24 Baba Sri John, Akka, Adidas Samrat. The true heart of the world said, mystical practices, understanding of the components of experience, responsible self-control, study and recitation of the written teaching, acts of self-purification and self-denial, ritual sacrifices, charitable and heartfelt service of others, the offering of gifts of money money and other goods to the church, fasting, devotional practices, spending of time in the holy places or sanctuaries, and every other kind of truly human responsibility are necessary, right, good, and appropriate for those who love me and who always commune with me. But none of these things is as effective, useful and auspicious in this way of communion with me as surrender to my living form. Such is done through loving spiritual association with, with my agent in the world who has realised me most perfectly and finally. The company of such a one as well as the general company of all others who submit to that one, is the essential means whereby all attachments to experience are dissolved by the radiant power of the true self. Those who truly hear my teaching surrender themselves to me in the form of my agent, who has realised me. In this manner, those who love me confess and demonstrate that I manifest myself in living forms through the instruments of nature. Therefore, see this truth in the form of the spiritual master. Surrender to him and serve him as my form. By grace of the power of enlightenment that radiates in that company, you will sever all association with experience via the mind. The independent subtle or astral personality that migrates from body to body in the experiential realm of changes. This is finally accomplished at the heart, the root of all coverings of the soul, when at last the true self is realised, there is nothing more to do. Then the devotee, the spiritual master and the radiant heart are made one through perfect realisation of self-transcending devotional sacrifice in me.